Hi, my name is Ryder, and today I'm going to be reviewing Rocket Man. Rocket Man is the newest in the recent trend of music biopics, and here it documents Elton John's rise to fame with the help of his lyricist Bernie Taupin and the struggles he faced off stage. I think what helps Rocket Man stand out from most other music biopics is that it's a full-on musical where the characters will actually get up and break out into song and dance. And I think it made it a lot more unique, and I feel like it was necessary here because it follows a very familiar formula that a lot of other music biopics do follow and it, it helped to make it more of its own thing. To summarize that formula, it goes something along the lines of the protagonist usually starting out with a rocky relationship with his family, discovers the music industry and uh, starts to rise up with their unique sound and style even though they've been told that they'll never make it. But after gaining all their fame, usually somebody like a personal assistant or, or a manager will kind of turn against them and end up being a bad influence and almost like nearly destroy their career. But by the end, the protagonist will get rid of that bad influence, whoever it is, out of their life and rise back to fame. As more of these music biopics come out and it doesn't look like they're going to stop making them because they're doing very well, the, this formula is going to become really repetitive. And I feel like if you're going to go with that formula, you should have some sort of unique quality to your film. And I feel like Rocket Man really does. There's a really great cast here and everybody does very well. Taron Edgerton especially, as Ellen John, does very well, and not only with his acting, but his musical ability. He and the rest of the cast perform every single song in this movie. You don't hear Ellen John's song, Ellen John's voice, until the, the credits of the movie. And I remember first seeing the trailers for this movie and being worried that they weren't going to use his actual voice, and I thought that would... I just thought I wouldn't be able to really immerse myself into this world and really feel like it's Ellen John, but to my surprise, it actually worked out very well, and I'm glad that they went in the direction of performing the songs themselves and re redoing them all. And I want to add, a lot of times in these musical sections, a lot of the the montages and some, some of the way certain scenes were shot, I thought was very well done. So overall, this is a good music biopic that manages to feel pretty unique. Not so much acting as a standard biopic, but more being based on a true fantasy with a, a really great cast and really great music. I'm really happy with how, with how this turned out, and if you're an Ellen John fan or just just a fan of musicals, I'd really recommend that you see this. Thanks for watching.